Hello Explorers, welcome back. So we are going to do Lennox's birthday binder. And we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 1. That, I think that's $5 off. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95. We are five dollars off. Because that should be two hundred dollars. But now that I'm thinking about that, that's probably too much. Oh well. We're doing it. Because I need to get money in here so that I can start paying for stuff. Or at least feel like I can start paying for stuff. Oh no. You guys, you're gonna find this hilarious. I hope at least. But, hang on. Okay, so. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hang on. Okay, so. The, the campground that we're at, um, we're in Pensacola and it's warm here. It's like 85 degrees out. It's beautiful, but it's hot. And our truck doesn't have AC. So we, um, when we left Orlando, it was cold because of the storm. Like it's been cold. Plus it was the middle of the night and I was freezing like to the point where I made Corey when he went to the gas, like when we went to the first gas station, I made him grab me a, my blanket out of our bedroom, like my actual blanket. Cause I was so cold. Um, so but then once we got up into, like, uh, the panhandle, it was hot because they're not dealing with the same storm. So when we got inside, by then I was sweating and I'm wearing a sweatshirt and sweatpants. So when we got inside, I was like, I need to film. So I literally just ripped off my sweatshirt and I've been sitting here with the windows open um, with no shirt on. No shirt on. I know too much information, but there was no, um, there was nobody in the site next to us. So it's just an empty site and then it's trees. So I was like, yeah, we're fine. Whatever. Well, of course I start filming this video and a class A pulls up next to us. And I was like, oh no, I gotta put a shirt on. Cause I don't know if they can see in our windows. I know at night you can see in our windows. I don't think during the day you can, but I'm not risking it. So... <laughs> Yeah, that's me. All right. Dark one's going to be for the top. This one will be for the bottom. This is from Save with Sippy Bear. And we have, I couldn't remember what I just said. So we have four and two. So we're going to do, I guess, a five and a five. Okay. $10. Because we don't have anything bigger. And I'm going to go ahead and do two on each of these. Because I know how, um, oh, you can't see that. I know how much money we always end up having at the end and we have to go through it like 14 times. So I'm going to try to avoid that by doing more than one each time. So let's go again. And we have a one and a three. All right, so that's a five and a five. Let's put this back and take a 10, or, wow. Take a 20, okay. This is coming along so nicely. And I will definitely do this challenge again, um, but I will probably do it for, like, just to put into her savings. Because I need to get back to putting stuff in their savings. So what do we have in here? We have $100 in the high yield. 20, 45, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 60, 1, 2. So 162, and this one brings in 300.
All right, so this one is from Lemon Ivy. So five, we're gonna go ahead and do two on here. And a six, so we're putting eleven dollars into this one. Okay. All right, so we have ten and eleven. So this one brings in $80 and it now has 20, 30, 40, 50, 1, 2, and 3. $53. Love that. Okay, this one is from Steps on a Budget. And I guess we're finishing this today. Oh, no, we're not. We're going to leave this at the 10. We might come back and finish this, but I'm not in a hurry. I'd rather get more done. Like, I'd rather get all the other ones closer being finished um, than spend all the money finishing one because it's the beginning of the month. So we have plenty of time to actually finish it. I know this has never been my strategy before, but I started thinking about it. And I was like, rather than like hammering down on one challenge at a time, if I do more on like the bigger challenges, then... At the end of the month, I have a bunch that are really close to being finished. And then I can come in and finish them up. So we have 20, 40, 55, 56, 57. Oh, so I know what that one is. We, we will finish it. We'll come back. All right, so this one is Disney cards. I don't know why I pulled all the cards out. Do not ask. I'm actually going to move these cards out of there because it's just going to be too much. Where are the... There they are. Let's pull three because I want to make progress on this. So eight. Eight. Oh gosh. Probably shouldn't have done that. So we have 20... Hold on. We have uh, 20... 36. Going into this challenge, that is a lot. So, 36. Oh my goodness. Okay, 20, 30, 5, and 6. But at least we're making progress. Because this one brings in, I believe, 420, if I remember correctly. So we have 20... Or we have 100 in the high yield, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4. 164. This one is from Lemon Ivy as well. Let's go ahead and do two. Um, maybe we should just do one to start because that's a nine. Yeah, let's make it through the... Uh, you know what? Actually, I think I only have one left. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and do two. So nine plus eight is 17. Okay. So 17, 10, 15. Whoops. 16, 17. So in this one, we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81. And it brings in 100. Okay. This one is from Champagne's Corner. And it brings in 75. And we got a 12 and a 10 holy crap we're putting 22 into this one 
That's like a third of it. Twenty-two. So ten, twenty, one, and two. My goodness. So in this one we have 10, 20, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 35. Almost halfway. Alright, let's go back up to this one and we'll finish it off. Should be a three. Yep, three dollars. So one, two, and three. So we have 20, 40, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. So this will go in with completed challenges. Oh my goodness, why? Why, why is this always my luck? They're landscaping. The day I get into a park, and I'm only going to be here a couple days. So let's add a new one in. Um, you know what? We'll add in a new, since we finished the steps on a budget, let's add another steps on a budget. We'll add in Rapunzel, and we'll go ahead and do, uh, we'll start on it. We'll do two. So $8. And five. So we're putting 13 into this one. It's a good way to start this off. So 10, 11, 12, 13. 13, 13. Okay, since we made it through the binder, I've decided instead of going back through the binder, since we did do two on every single one and we added a new one and we finished, I still want the money to go into her birthday because that's the whole reason I brought more money. Um, because I definitely knew I did not need that much money to get through her binder. But I need, I do need money going towards her birthday. So what I'm going to do is we're actually going to work on flights. Because flights goes for all of my challenges. But also, you know what? Let me see. Are there any other locations in here that have to do with her birthday? Because if they do, we'll do it. Did I already do her birthday one? I feel like there is no way that Ren would not have a, like Paris ones. We have Amsterdam, Athens, Bangkok, Dubai, Hong Kong, Bora Bora, Budapest, Buenos Aires, it is, I don't know. Tokyo, Sydney, Vancouver, Venice, Tuscany, Seattle, Melbourne, Kyoto, Los Angeles, Shanghai, Santorini, In Istanbul, New York City, Prague, Rio de Janeiro, San Francisco. I feel like there is no way she wouldn't have something in there for France. There's no way. So now I'm like looking through the cards to make sure I didn't already do it. So there's this one, but this is not from the 2025 ones. The 2025 ones have two things on them. That's just from my regular challenge one. Oh, you know what, you guys? It wouldn't even have been in there, I don't think. I don't know. Let me see. I think it'd be in the front of this. Which ones have we done? Oh, we did it. We did it. That's why. Okay. 
I thought I was losing my mind. I'm like, there's no way Ren would not have that in there. Okay, so we're going to work on flights. Let's see what we can do. What do we owe? $59. Let's see. 10, 20, 30, 40, 55, 56, 7, 8, and 9. We are able to do this one. And then we can figure out what the next one is. That is amazing. So in flights, there's 2,000 in a high yield. Again, there's not exactly 2,000 in there because we did spend out of it. Um, once it gets up to 2,000, I will... Let me see how much we need to get to 2,000 actually. Because I have paid for all of our flight stuff. So what's in there now is just like what's actually in there. So in order to act accurately have these two um, placeholders... We'll do 2,000 minus what's actually in there, which is 1795. Wow. Minus 1795. So we need $205. Let's see. 1, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 2, and 5. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this money and I'm going to put this into my high yield so that this 2,000 is accurate and then the rest of this is actually what we have over it. So, while I have you guys on here, I'm gonna go ahead and do it and I'll show you. So, transfer from my bank account into flights, 205. And the transfer, I'm gonna cover obviously my account info. Oh, hold on. I always forget that I have to like, okay. And you can see there I transferred, it says your transfer is in progress, $205. So now it's going to show, let me cover up my account number, but now I had $1,795 and now I have a current balance of $2,000. That's just my available because it hasn't cleared yet. So now there's actually 2000 in the bank and this is, or in the high yield, and this is what we have in there. 2010, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 5, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72. 2072 dollars. And one of the reasons I went ahead and did this, one, I wanted that to be accurately represented, but also because I told you guys I don't have any like large bills. And so by pulling this 205 now, and I've already transferred the money, this doesn't need to go back to the bank. This can get cashed up because I've already put the money where it belongs. I pulled it from my bank account to do it. So that is going to be a huge help. All right, let's do this one up here. Minnesota. Usually flights from Las Vegas to Minnesota are actually pretty low. Um, okay, sir, why are you squeaking? Weird. So let's see what the average... Average cost, not the average cost, what is the cost of a flight? Flights from Las Vegas to Minnesota. And we use Expedia and it says $58. We do Expedia and then we look at what the one way lowest price is. So $58 to Minnesota and that's what we will work on in one of the next videos, binders, I have no idea. But I love that this is back up to 2000 because we are getting ready to purchase our Cancun flights as soon as we have the money, or not the money, as soon as we have the dates locked in. So now we have left one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You guys already know where this is going. You should know. Oh, we can keep we can keep this open. And let me bring that book back. All right. We are gonna put it into. Well, if I can find it, there it is this one. 
So what did I say we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we're going to do this five. We're going to do these two fours. Once this one's done, we'll go back to doing the um, catch-all. So we only have $14 left for this one. Let's count this and see. That should mean we have $280 in here. 1, 2, 2, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 41, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 80. 280 dollars we need 14 dollars to complete this that is so exciting i'm so excited and then that's 294 dollars that's going to get um randomized at the end of the month like that's really really exciting i might take 94 of it at the end of the month and put it straight to the credit card and then randomize the 200 because that would be i think a smart move so we did a lot. We finished a challenge. We added a new challenge in. We made, we did two on everything in the binder. We knocked out another flight. We got 205 sent over to high yield so it can be earning interest. Meaning we broke 2000 in flights again. Or we made progress on Jen's challenge. Like I'm really, really happy with how today went. So that is officially all that I have for you guys today. And I will see you back here tomorrow board games and challenges. So until next time.